Let's see if you can identify each of these three types of inheritance. Now each of these is a type of non-Mendelian genetics, which means they don't follow Mendel's simple rules. I'm going to show you an illustration of each and you have to figure out which one it is. All right, here's the first one. This is when a single gene is going to affect many different phenotypes. In this case, it's the beta globin gene mutation. And this single gene can create blindness, liver failure, or heart attacks in an individual. So again, multiple traits are affected by one gene. And this is an example of pleiotropy. All right, here's our second type of inheritance. This is when one gene is going to control the expression of a second gene. In this example, the first gene is going to control the production of hair, while the second gene is going to control the production of what color that hair is. And this is an example of epistasis. And here's our last type of inheritance. This is when many genes are going to control the phenotype of one trait. This specific illustration is showing us the wide variety of human heights in men and women. And this is because there isn't just one gene for human height, there are many genes that are going to influence how tall someone is. And this is an example of polygenic inheritance.